And today we want to take a look at the code to animate, uh, to create animated GIF or GIF with uh, with Python, and we wanna take a look at a little improvement that we made from uh, from the last thing we did. Uh, if you have seen my post in the my latest post, you have seen how to animate uh, things that we can draw onto an image with PIL and then save it and uh, we can also draw text instead of of uh, a circle like this uh, we have also this is also I don't know if I talked about it, about this code how to make uh, um, an animation this is an animation but not made with the uh, with the draw text uh, uh, one by one, but it's um, it's a number of frames, number of PNGs that have been uh, uh, put uh, one after another into the frame, so they are not created um, on the on the fly. Okay, so this is to use uh, was made to use PNG that already exist. Instead, this, uh, this and this and this are made um, drawing onto, onto the image, an image or a, or a text, and then uh, save it, saving it into a frame and then saving it as a, an animated GIF. Instead, in this, you take uh, different PNGs into the frames and then create an animated GIF. If uh, I don't know if I've been clear, then we made another example here where we create different frames from a text here, these two text line of text. Then we uh, abstracted a little bit this thing um, instead of making uh, one line, one uh, variable for each line, we created a, a list of, uh, of strings. Uh, with split lines from a multi-line uh, string and then we uh, went with this so we can easily write into the, this code and make a long um, a long text in an easy way now we want to go from and then we also change the colors of this one put it on a larger image with uh, with a background and and that was the last thing that we did then uh, then I did this there is an, uh, another change adding something as you can see here I've added um, a speech from Romeo and Juliet and then I put it here well this is one word at a time this could be nice for experimenting some uh, kind of banner not one to, to display not just one letter at a time but uh, a word at a time but this is this is not what I want to make you see even if I can put this on uh, on my blog to if you are interested in watching this code but the things that I did after this Modif um, changing a little bit this thing here was this it's always the same uh, speech from uh, script from uh, Romeo and Juliet and is a uh, uh, Benvolio and uh, Romeo uh, speaking so I wanted to make a banner where uh, these two guys shows what they are telling here I made some uh, adjustment here to see what what was better and uh, I thought that was better to have uh, one character at a time for reading it was better than one word at a time uh, this is what I did and then I made some changes that I want to show you now making making you see with sublime text here and here is the final result, result. so we have one letter at a time but we have also the image here of the character that is talking 
this is Benvolio and this is Romeo so I think it's more clear than in the other banner who is talking um, and so I think this is quite nice uh, it's more nice than the nicer than uh, than the previous that you've seen before so in the next video I will explain uh, the code line by line and but for now I will leave this one on my the code of this one on my on my blog thank you